Okay, I think I'm ready to meet my doom. Berea Hard Airport. Bad thing is when the middle bat of the sequential battles is, has AP an AP condition, but so that means if I fail to get it, I'd have to start from the from the first battle again. It really sucks. And there's a main game before the first battle too. This is quite possibly one of the worst sections of the game. Going through here will take us to the airport, right? Hmm, I don't see any staff around. That's probably due to the flight restrictions. The gate looks to be open just enough for us to enter too. Did we? Yeah, I might as well. I already got everything I need here anyways. Enter. I don't know who or what will be waiting for us beyond here, but it doesn't matter at this point. Let's go. Right. Uh. Anyways, well, at the airport, we're saving a separate slot. Uh. There's supposed to be a freeze court somewhere. Go downstairs from the southwest. Oh. First, I should actually start heading west. Um. Uh. What the? Um. You gonna let me head southwest or not? Wow, well, Brayhart Airport's as nice as I pictured it being. <clears throat> it's my first time visiting it as well. I suppose this must be an airliner? Yup, it's the kind used in the Empire. Yeah, it's a medium-sized passenger airliner made by the Reinford Company. I've been waiting for you. And who might you be? I was sent here to deliver a message. You see that airship right there? Make your way to the lounge on the third floor post haste, is what I was told. Uh. Oh, whoops. Yeah. Okay, that was suspicious. I hope I didn't miss anything about message I accidentally sped through. Shoot. Oh, I have to head inside the airship first in order to get the treasure. Whoops, I misread that. Uh. Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to lay off the turbo function, even in cutscenes. This airship is massive. Indeed, although it naturally couldn't hold to compare to the Courageous in terms of size. We were instructed to go to the third floor lounge. But please, stay on guard. There's no telling who the person calling us is, or what they have in mind. Right. <clears throat> um... I guess this is the hold? It's awfully spacious, for one. I there was supposed to be a treasure here. Oh, isn't this a pleasant surprise? There's a treasure chest here. This is a normal freeze. Uh, I wish I could turn some of these in for you materials so I can uh, uh, so I can upgrade other stuff. Is there even anything inside these rooms? Not really. Alright, nothing to see here. Okay, there's a uh Keep using them separate slots. May have to use a very mix of cut stuff. Oh shoot, wrong way. Hey, let's just take off this airship. This hijack it. Yeah. Or not. Okay, I guess I have to go upstairs <coughs> to get to the lounge. Uh, there it is. And there we will run to someone. Go. Oh. 
you certainly took your time. <gasps> Yusis! I suspected it was you. How long did you intend to make me wait? I have wondered whether you would even bother to show up. Be fair, your, your place is the hardest to get into for us rebels. Do you know how much trouble you made us go through to get here? <clears throat> there are eyes everywhere in this city. It would have drawn too much attention for you to come here directly. That was just my way of looking out for you. Perhaps you could try thanking me. <sighs> <laughs> At least you're well. That's what matters. It really is great to see you again, Yusis. The same to you. I'm impressed you were able to overcome the many ordeals you've no doubt faced to make it this far. But should I be surprised, I wonder? I've always had high expectations of you. <laughs> I doubt I would have been able to come this far if not for everyone's help, though. You're not going to try to turn me in, are you? Turn me into the Noble Alliance. Still, thanks, Yusis. You're not going to become like a Tales game trader, are you? We already have that with Crow. <laughs> this means that all of Class 7 is finally together again. And I couldn't be more overwhelmed with joy. Congratulations, everyone. Thank you so much. <laughs> You've been a tremendous part of making this happen. Thank you, Sharon. <laughs> I haven't the foggiest idea what Sharon is doing here, but I suppose it doesn't matter right now. Uses? Er, so, yeah, you're gonna turn us in, aren't you? Oh no. I've been kept abreast of your activities through the Noble Alliance's information network. So I'm well aware you've been fighting <clears throat> their forces across the land using that ash-colored knight of yours. As well as the fact that you've chosen not to ally yourselves with the Imperial Army, but instead fight as a third faction. Do we really count as a f completely as a third faction? We are teaming up with Claire and... well... <gasps> oh, has word of Valimar been getting around that much? That said, I didn't arrange for us to meet like this just to see one another again. I did so that I could make the difference between our respective positions crystal clear. What do you mean? I see. You have no intention of coming with us, do you? No! This is a joke, right? You surely saw this coming. I'm the son of one of the most influential figures in the Noble Alliance. And as I imagine you're already aware, I've been assisting him and his provincial army in fighting this war. Well, we know, but... Is this what you believe to be your duty as a noble? Meanwhile, my brother is acting as the Alliance Force's Chief of Staff. And as for my father... He was responsible for hiring Jaegers to attack Ymir. Which is not only your home, but the home of all the kind-hearted people who welcomed me with open arms earlier in the year. <sighs> yeah, going there would be kind of awkward right now. I'm sure they'll, they'll understand. Your, your situation, right? I can only apologize. If I returned home earlier, then perhaps... No. I don't even have the right to do that much. Yet with that in mind, it should be clear that we can't go back to the way things were. The gulf between us is simply too vast to be filled. Our paths have parted. That is reality. Yusis, please! No! Who's gonna, who's gonna triple buff everyone? It doesn't <clears throat> have to be like this, Yusis. <sighs> I will guarantee you safe passage out of the city. If you deem it necessary, I can even have you escorted out by car. However, once you're out, we can no Yusis. I can understand why you feel somewhat responsible for what happened in Ymir. I can understand why you, as an Alborea, feel as though certain things are inherently expected of you. Actually, I should probably tell you that Dad woke up the other day. All that's left is for him to get his stamina back now. He'll make a full recovery. That's... that's good news. 
I would have liked to pay him a visit myself. But with circumstances as they are. Oh, don't worry about it. I'm not telling you that to make you feel guilty. I'm telling you because I don't want that to be your reason for what you're doing. Pardon? What I want to know is what you want to do, and the path you want to take. If you want to help your family because you agree with the ideals of the Noble Alliance, I won't stop you. But if that's not what you want to do, if you're only helping because you feel like you have to for whatever reason, if you're doing it because you feel responsible for what happened to my dad, which, by the way, you aren't, or if you're doing it because, as much as you want to come with us, you feel like you don't have the right to, then you're nothing more than a coward who's running away. And I don't believe that's how a real Erebonian noble should act. They should do what they believe is right, and do it with pride. If Dad was here now, he'd say the same thing. Uh. It's kind of harsh. It might sound cold, but he's right. We're only students, still learning more about the world around us. Alone, we don't have the experience or knowledge to go around proposing solutions to the conflicts in this country. Not to the war going on around us, nor to the class divides that started it. But that's alone. And that's why I think we all need to come together as a class again. We're all inexperienced, but we all come from different backgrounds and social standings, and we each have unique experiences to share. It's only by pulling those together that we can overcome whatever life throws at us. It's worked for us during every one of our field studies. Why wouldn't it work now? Uh. <laughs> He's right, Eusis. Indeed. Reen had to remind me of that too, you know. It's always nerve-wracking for those of us who have to watch you pull crazy stunts all the time, I hope you know. <laughs> it certainly is. I see my suspicions were dead on. No matter the circumstances, you've always been the one to blow away my hesitations. Then you'll come with us? Still, no matter what you say, I am an Alborea, and as such I have duties and responsibilities to fulfill. If you are determined not to back down, then we will have to settle this with a duel, just as you and Crow did one month ago. A duel? Follow me, Reen. Unfortunately, it's going to also involve a racing game for some reason. Ugh. The good thing is, on a racing game, you can retry it, but still, it, it's going to make getting to the uh, uh, to the AP conditional battle really, really tedious. Our destination is Aurox Canyon. That's why I'm. That's it's a good thing I have a mini mux. So you don't have to watch me do the same stuff over and over again. There, we shall settle <clears throat> this matter once and for all. Well, well. I wasn't counting on this. I'd only intended to gather information on the Crimson Wings, and yet here I am, bearing witness to such a compelling scene. I've no duty to report anything I see to Duke Alborea, but I suppose there isn't any harm in watching how things unfold. <sighs> Whatever. Do what you want. I don't care. I'll just go kill time in town or something. Oh no! Not this time! You're coming with me and that's that! Yeah, apparently it's a new Ouroboros rule that everyone has to have a buddy system. Because almost every boss we've been fighting so far it has been coming in pairs. Yes, they have learned the, uh, the buddy system. We're, we're doomed now. I'm here to support you, not babysit you. You're the one with a number, not me. Try acting like it. Fine, fine. What a pain. There's a familiar face among them, so this might not be a total waste of time.
Uh, you're gonna watch me get smoked by Usus in this stupid racing minigame. Uh. It'd be nice if they let me have some practice with the damn motorcycle first. Isn't this Angelica's bike? I thought she entrusted it to you after <clears throat> she withdrew, Ring. What in the world is it doing here? Did Eustis bring it? I made use of my family's influence to have it brought here from the Academy. Since then, it's been left in the hands of a skilled mechanic, so it's been well maintained. You will be riding that for our duel. You mean our duel will be a race between me on this bike and you on that horse? Oh no. Partially. The finish line will be the plateau where we fought that monster during our field study. How am I gonna get there fast enough? Once there, we shall begin a sword fight to determine the victor. Why are you making this so complicated? Let's just have a let's just walk there and then have a sword fight. Whoever arrives first will therefore have the advantage of more time to prepare. Oh. We did stuff like that back in the core too. Oh no. We called them chase battles. You had to make good use of the terrain to win. I I've never actually ridden this outside of a cutscene. This that is does sound quite this similar is really to what mean. I had in mind. At least they gave me a retry option, but still. Okay. I understand what we're going to do. Uh, okay, so I just need to use left stick for steering and then uh, uh, L and R for braking and accelerating. So if I win, you're coming with us, right? You're not backing out? Correct. In the unlikely event that you defeat me, I will concede and go with you. But know this, I have absolutely no intention of holding back. That bike of yours may have the advantage in terms of speed, but I know this area like the back of my hand. And the horse would probably be more maneuverable. Do not expect this to be an easy battle. Oh, I won't. I'll be coming at you with all I've got. <laughs> I would expect no less. Uh. too fired up about this. <laughs> we'll have to simply stand aside and see what unfolds. Right. We'll go and take up places along the course to watch. In that case, I will signal when to begin. Rest assured, I wouldn't dream of giving either party an unfair advantage. That works for me. How about you, Yusis? Very well. Let's begin. Oh no. Uh. Good luck, Reen. Go get him. I, I do not go. know how to drive a but I don't even know how to drive a motorcycle in real life. I'm screwed. Yep, RB, LB, and uh, and left stick. Uh Uh, I don't even know where to go. I'm ready, Yusis. As am I. Now demonstrate to me the strength of your resolve. All right. Take your positions, please. Three. Two. One. Begin! I don't even know the right way to go. Do I even get to open my mi mini-map here? Can I just run him off the road, please? Please? Go, go! I don't even know where, which plateau they're talking about. Take a left here. Ah! Use this path here. Everyone's really into this. No! This is the worst part. Ah! Did I win? Yes! I did it! First try, even though I kind of <laughs> screwed up at some points. Ah. Okay, Yusus, now I'm gonna... I have my evade setup on, yes, so you're screwed. You might as well just throw in the towel now. You'll never hit me at this rate. Can I save first, please? Your performance was admirable, I'll admit. Even if you did crash right into Emma... And, pro and probably broke all our bones before the big boss battle. Yeah, way to go, Reen. I mean, end me. Ouch. The advantage is mine, Yusis. Let's settle this once and for all. 
No matter, a handicap like this will hardly pose a problem for me. Come at me, Reen. Let's do this. Come at me with all you have. My turn. Vita, just try to hit me. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Oh crap, he has his own speed up. No. Well, her bow scope you first. Level 75. He's actually pretty strong. All right, let's do this. Too slow. Here I go. Okay, right now I need to recast Shining so I don't get hit like an Arcus activate. Arcus activate. Boom. Here I go. Slight AT delay. Aya. Too slow. Here I go. Okay, I need to start buffing my strength. Beat up. Too slow. I'm just getting started. Here I go. Um, see, he's actually resistant to AT delay, but my speed is up, so he's getting hit with it more often. Too slow. Let's move. Okay, I'm just gonna hit you go. one more time because really not much else for me to do now. I scanned you. Uh, this isn't... Okay, it's safe for now. <clears throat> Looks like I win this one. I should have expected no less. It's hard to believe how much your swordsmanship has improved in such a short period of time. Don't sell yourself short, Eusis. If I'd held back even a little, I'd be the one kneeling on the ground right now. Your skills really shone through, both in the race and our duel. If we were both using horses... I can't pretend to have held back either. If we were both using horses, he would have won for sure, though. He would have had an advantage in the duel itself too if he got uh, if he got to move first. The victory is well and truly yours, Reen. Well, maybe not because I still had insight to begin with thanks to Falco Courts. Reen, Yusus, are you both all right? Oh, hey guys. Well, you're already finished. Looks like we've got a winner. <laughs> the verdict should be plainly obvious. Yeah, I managed to scrape through. It was pretty close, though. Hmm. Was it? Does that mean you'll come back with us? I fought with all my might. I performed to the very best of my abilities, holding nothing back. And even then, I couldn't compare to your strength and resolve. With that, I have no more reservations. The path I should take is the same as yours. <laughs> About time. We're happy to have you with us, of course. We'll find the answers we seek together. And together, we'll bring Crow back, too. You can count on me. Starting today, I am a member of Class 7 once again. I'll show my father and brother just how I believe one bearing the name Alborea should live. I feel embarrassed.
embarrassed just watching you two. There's nothing to feel embarrassed about. This is just part of how we are as a class. First show this moment to Dorothy. <laughs> That's very true. There are some things you learn only by directly confronting those you care about. I know this much from experience. <laughs> you and I both know a thing or two about that, don't we, Fee? Good thing I brought Fee along too, then I, I get this little tidbit. Sure do. <laughs> Congratulations on reuniting nearly everyone in Class 7. I suppose now is the best time to start thinking about what to do next. <laughs> I wouldn't celebrate your paltry victory just yet. Who was that? Up there. She says she doesn't have a number. That means she's not really an enforcer, huh? Who are they? One of them is wearing armor. Oh dear. <laughs> Good day to you, ladies and gentlemen of Class 7. I'm afraid I've come to thoroughly put a damper on your reunion. I hope you don't mind. She knows us? Just who are you? Well, at least one among you should already be familiar with me. But it wouldn't hurt to introduce myself for the benefit of the others. I am a lady after all. My name is Duvali. I'm the head knight of the Stalritter, an esteemed group led by Ouroboros' seventh Angus in all her glory. I guess there's non-enforcer groups affiliated with Ouroboros, kind of like with the Fur Chain Factories. Only, this group probably uh, has more warriors than scientists. And it is by her order that I have come here today. You're with Ouroboros? So the Steel Maiden sent you, did she? Ugh, looks like our luck just ran out. Might I ask if the Stall Ritter is somehow related to the Eisen Ritter? The name is eerily similar. Even their only difference in name is related, with iron and steel being two metals. And steel, I, I think the steel use iron. I'm not very uh, familiar with. Yeah, it does. You, it's it's an alloy of iron and carbon, so. It's sh it, so yeah, it, 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 the name is pretty similar indeed. Oh, you're the Arsade, aren't you? <laughs> are you curious? Hmm? I'll bet you are. Well, I'm not going to tell you. <gasps> Pardon? <laughs> Does it bug you? Does it? This is this is exactly what Falcom likes their uh, 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 to keep saying to their fans when they're always dropping hints and 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 stuff like that about uh, potential spoilers. Your curiosity is going to build and build and eat away at you until you can't even sleep at night. Yeah, Dubly is obviously uh, 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 is obviously in charge of writing the entire series. In fact, I bet she- I bet this entire- all three games are just her retelling of this- of- all- of- of, of, of pretty much everything Ouroboros does. Yes, I- she- after she, Ouroboros took over the world, she decided to become a game developer. Clearly. That- that's- that's how my head canon is gonna make it. <laughs> Sucks to be you! Welcome, employee of the year. Is she really with Ouroboros? I'm not quite that curious. I wouldn't want to pressure you into discussing something you aren't comfortable sharing. Hold on a minute. There's no point in pretending you don't care. I know full well you do. She doesn't act like it, but there's no doubting she's extremely powerful. 
Indeed, she may not be an enforcer, but not for lack of skill. Although the power of the man beside her is even more frightening. <clears throat> Leaving me aside for the moment. I've already introduced myself. It's only proper for you to do... Ugh! Why are you still up there? Get down here right this instant! <sighs> what do you need me for? You can handle him just fine yourself. Oh, for goodness sake! You're supposed to be number one. Would it kill you to even put the tiniest bit of effort into your job? Enforcer number one. Number one? How does they decide all the numbers for all the enforcers anyway? It doesn't always denote their strength because Renee is considered stronger than Joshua, and yet she, I think she has a, uh, she's like number 15 or something while Joshua is 13. I, I forgot. Then he's an enforcer just like Sharon and Phantom Thief B. And he's supposed to be on a whole nother tier. <laughs> Indeed. I happen to be number 9. An enforcer's number is not in any way indicative of their combat prowess. Yeah, Campanella is supposed to be... Well, Joshua claims Campanella is about on his level, but... Campanella could be holding back his strength and st or something. But by coincidence, his may actually be so. He's easily among the strongest in Ouroboros. Perhaps even the strongest. Stronger than number zero and all the uh, anguies. <laughs> Never tried firing <clears throat> steel to see which one of us gets the top spot, though. That race before was kind of fun to watch. So let's see what you got. Can we just change this to another motorcycle duel? I think that might be slightly more winnable than an actual battle against these two. The name's McBurn. Some call me the Almighty Conflagration. And talk is cheap. <clears throat> I hate conversations that just drag on and on. So let's skip to the good part, okay? Oh no. You know, maybe we should start bringing two guest characters from Ymir from now on. Uh, if I had a Claire here as well, I could, I could get a quite an advantage in, in getting more turns than the enemy. The power radiating from him is incredible. What are those flames? <laughs> Shall we begin? My swift swordsmanship was taught to me by my illustrious lord, the Steel Maiden. And you haven't a chance in hell of withstanding it. I've gone to the trouble of coming down here. Do me a favor and try lasting a minute before you call it quits. Your arrogance will be your undoing. Give them everything you've got. Wait, don't tell me you this is going to be forced my party. Oh no. Don't talk too easy on me now. Now, draw your weapons. You can take a little heat. Let's move. Oh, come on! Do not- Why did they do this to me? Always screwing up my party when I need it the most! What kind of game is this? This is cruel and unusual, I say. I do not have uses properly prepared for this fight at all. Uh, I'm gonna have to switch out Laura with Emma in order to get reflection set up. Uh, this, this game can be really unfair sometimes, like the developers are just doing this to be evil. Ah, uh, Such cruelty! Why the hell are you all- what are you doing all the way back there? No! What am I supposed to do here? This is really a. This is really gonna suck. Um. Heavenly gift on these three for now. Ugh. 
This game can be really, really unfair. It's like, what the fuck were they thinking? Why? Present shell. Blame brand. Ugh. Aha. Come on. Come on. I'll handle this. Yeah, he's immune to being set on fire, obviously. And she's pretty much immune to everything, too. This does not seem very fair. I leave this to you. Will do. I'm gonna have to overdrive with someone if I can. My turn. Uh. Seriously, this is such an unfair battle. They can't just. F this game really needs to learn not to screw up your formation like that. It's as cruel and unusual, I say. Ah. Uh. Everyone evasion up now. My turn. Ah. Overdrive. Okay, do that real quick. I can do this. What? Very well. Take long. Oh, I'm actually to tease the layer a little bit. Whoa. My turn. Reflected. All right, good. How many turns has it been? When should I start S-Craft spamming everyone? Uh, I'm not even close to beating Dually yet. Nice, Brand! Uh. 
What to do? I don't even know how many turns it's been yet. This is really bad. I just have everyone mass S craft dubly. That's why one no. Okay, I think I can make it. If I add a judgment arrow, it should be able to finish Dumoli off. Ah! Let's just throw that in just in case. Ah! I just realized I forgot to scan McBurn. Whatever. You know what? Screw the uh, screw. Scanning my enemies. It's not worth it. I'm sick of it. This is a stupid mechanic and you guys should feel ashamed for even implementing it this way. Yeah, whatever. It's not gonna even scratch you. Yeah, everyone dies. Boom. What the hell? She survived? Never mind. No. You know what? Screw the scanning. I don't care. I beat Dually. That's all that matters. I'll just. Uh, Is that really what you call everything you got? I'll, I'll just look it up on. Uh, I'll just. Uh, I'll just look up his stats later. I'll just have someone give me the stats later or something. I don't know. Seriously. Be happening. Yeah, scanning every single enemy is just not worth it, is it? How can they be so strong? I've never fought anyone so strong in my life. Not by a long shot. Well, I can always do it again off screen, I guess. I didn't expect we would have a chance against him head on. We were able to knock that knight down, at least. Ugh! I can't believe I lost to mere students! Of course, one of them had to be an arsenic. This is so humiliating! Well, you're we still numbered, so... Oh, give me a break. Were you even trying? I thought you beat Luve once. Hard to believe with that sorry side of a fight. I did. Granted, he won the other 99 or so battles. And I was! I simply slipped, that's all! Interesting. You mixed by any chance? What are you talking about? Nothing. If you haven't noticed yourself, I'm not gonna be the one to tell you. If you haven't, it's probably not much anyway. Huh? What are you... Anyway, I'm out of here. You can take care of handing them over to the Duke. You can't possibly be serious! You won't help even a teensy bit. It's a little much to handle all by myself. 
Nah, I'm tired of this already. Maybe if one of them could seriously give me a run for my Mira, I'd consider it. But... One run for your Mira coming right up! Seriously, huh? I, can't I can't believe the scanning system of these games. Hey, Kumi! Uh. <laughs> she finally made it. I'm going to do a new game plus just to get the black records anyway, so I might as well just save all the en- I'm just going to save the tougher enemy scans for new game plus. That's probably the best way. Nice. Let's face it, this is- getting everyone scanned is properly is kind of a bullshit mechanic. <sighs> Looks like I was right to hurry. I wasn't expecting to find you fighting monsters of this caliber. You're- Instructor Sarah? Sorry for the wait. But don't you worry your pretty little heads none. Now that I'm here, I won't let them lay a finger on you. How could I call myself your homeroom teacher if I did? <laughs> Thanks. You're the purple lightning, aren't you? Huh. Hey, I've heard of you. What's Sarah doing here? We are dreaming, are we? Was this your doing, Eusis? <laughs> I used a secret channel to contact her. She was to be our insurance if things took a turn for the worse. Really? <laughs> I'm delighted to see that you're well, Lady Sarah. Thanks, I guess. Still, looks like you've been fighting some of your old pals for the sake of my kids. And I can give credit where it's due. Thanks. Ugh. Do you seriously want to keep fighting? Surely you don't believe you'll win because you're an A-rank bracer. <laughs> you ask me, this is more like it. I'm pretty sure even Sarah won't be able to scratch him. Not like there are any towns nearby I can burn down, so maybe it's time I stopped holding back. Stay away from him! Those are just like... Seems a lot like Green's power. Hold on a moment! I know I said I wanted help, but I'd rather you didn't send me on fire in the process! What the devil are you doing up there? The hell? That sounds like... Duke Albarea? Father? Or no? Lord Eusis. Eusis, what is the meaning of this? You dare to leave a letter like that and simply disappear? Have you gone mad? Letter? Hey, Duke. You mind staying out of this? I was getting all fired up there before you came and ruined everything. Silence! This has nothing to do with you. I will not stand for behavior like this, Eusis. You will do as I say! Your selfish actions will smear mud on the good Alvarea name! Is that what you want? You already smeared it beyond recognition. My intentions are as I outlined in the contents of that letter. I intend to walk my own path with my classmates at my side. I have no wish to dirty the Alvarea name. On the contrary, I wish to find for myself how I should live as one who bears it. Uses. What is this drivel? I always knew what a mistake it was to accept you into this family! Come forth, Knights of Kreutzen! Four of them? Can Valmar handle all that? Oh boy, here comes trouble. These must be the soldats from Oryx Fort. I don't recognize that one either. Yeah, this cutscene is way too freaking long, and there's way too many back-to-back -back battles. Screw scanning them right now. I'm waiting until I'm... Uh, I'm I better do my, uh, my second playthrough, since there will be one. One of the, one of the f f bonus bosses is hidden behind... Uh, is locked behind New Game Plus, so... 
I'm gonna have to do it anyways. I'm gonna have to fight them again anyway, so might as well put off scanning the tougher ones. It must be a new model. Dang, if it weren't for this stupid AP, if it weren't for this time limit on every battle, it'd be so much easier to scan them. Why would they do such a thing? It is cruelty. Cruelty, I say. Hector. Yeah, there goes any interest I had left. Have a blast. See ya. You always be so indifferent. Reen. Right. Looks like it's your turn to shine. I wonder if Valimar could beat that. Uh, 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 beat McBurn. Are you gonna call Valimar? No matter the results, we can't turn back. Take care, Master Reed. Heed my call. Valimar, the Ashen Knight! At harvest. Ah. Uh, seriously, the scanning mechanic is uh, still makes me so mad. Ah. I'm just gonna have to ask ask someone to screenshot it or something for me. I don't know. An ash colored knight? Huh. So that's the foul fiend that caused trouble for the soldiers from the Twin Dragons Bridge. Oh, so that's the Ashen Knight? The very same great knight that fought near Trista at that. And I can sense even more mana coming from it now than I could then. <laughs> its form is most impressive. Wonder if we can steal any more weapons from them. With them in our custody, the top spot in the Alliance is as good as mine. Show them the terrifying strength of the newest addition to our army. Yes, Sir Chris. We have to deal with an armored vehicle as well. That's pretty crazy. Uh, I beat Dually. Good enough. Tough. Damn it. Heavily armored too. Uh. But I'm sure Valimar can take it. Right. In the one-one one fight, this. maybe. I'm counting on you, Valimar. I'll do so. Use your links well. Uh oh. Ow. Any new crafts? Not really. Heavenly Slash. Be nice if I had an AOE move. Anyways, according to the guide, I should beat the- I should fight Armored Car first. It has no unbalanced weaknesses in its idle stance, so any part is fine. Shoot, Sarah's not added. What about you? Good luck. I'll show Do you have you any anything cool for us? Defense boost. That's not. Ah. Oh well. What do I you have? To you. Understood. Radiant wings. Strength up. I leave this to you. Will do. All right, speed up. This is going to be a sucky battle, oh boy. What the? What's it doing? It's doing some kind of stance. Good 
Bitte! Ha! Yeah, since I don't have that Kui Gong art anymore, uh, craft anymore, I have to use this. Anyways, right now, I can, it, in this state, I can unbalance it. Or not. It's still only a 75% chance, I think. Oh no. Oh no. I have to hurry up and kill this thing quick. Anti-tank cannon. I still don't have enough for morning freaking moon. Die. Okay, heal, heal, heal. Yeah. Allow me. Ow. Morning, moon. Bring it on. Did I dodge this? Yes. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. Onward. Take this. Okay, this thing's pretty much dead. Let's just kill it. Well, now's my chance to unbalance you, so let's see. The Hector in this stance, I should target its body, I think. Yeah. Let's go. Gotcha. Let's go. Heavy charge. Oh, that hurt. All right. Head is weak the weak point right now. Well, relatively speaking, it's not an, a guaranteed unbalance unfortunately. Only a 75% chance. this state head once again leave this to me boom bring it on bring it on Gotcha! Yes, come on, unbalance! Yes! Yes, buffed up counter attacks are the win. Double, bu uh, double strength up. Yes. Let's see you handle my counter attack now. Okay. Head. It's working. Keep it up. Onward. Take this.
Ah! Moving again so soon. Oh. Now, I want to see Laura's finisher. Come on, unbalance! No! Okay. This is a different stance? What? Oh, hell no. What's going on? Is the body not the weak point anymore? Is this an undiscovered stance? I'll try again anyway. Oh! That's weird. Oh, the body is still the weak point. That's weird. I thought it would have recorded for for a longer time. Anyways. Oh shoot, wrong button. I wanted to use the other one. Oh well, sorry Laura. I guess you won't get your chance to shine. Ah. And it didn't finish it off. Shoulder cannons. Oh shoot. Whatever, I'm still on- I- I can still- You can kill yourself already! And I'll just kill off in one hit anyways, alright. That's strange, let me use Dragon Blade immediately! Well, that, that's kinda nice, I guess. I guess if it's- if it's already dead, it just lets me do it just to look cool. I guess that's kinda nice. Yeah. I did not even know that was possible. I was like, wait, why do I suddenly get the, get the opportunity to press, uh, uh, to, to use my, uh, my, uh, my, uh, my, t my t team finisher? Uh. This can't be happening. How can our new soul type be defeated? Damn you. You think he's ready, Selene? He should be. Everyone to the spirit path, run away! Green! Give us a hand, Emma! We're going to open the spirit path! Yeah, right. being those two uh, uh, Drakens is gonna, is gonna take a while. It'd be a lot easier if I at least had an ally. Then I could t then. You just uh, then we'd be more evenly matched with all these enemy teams. Time to make our escape. Wait, Uses! You can't leave like this. I won't allow it. Farewell for now, Father. Please give my regards to Rufus as well. It is my dearest wish that you won't repeat the mistake you made with Ymir a second time. Oh no, might I ask you to return the horse I borrowed to the mansion? As you wish, Lord Eusus. Wait, wait, I say! That is an order, Eusus! Lots of class seven found. They finally they left Berea hard, but even with all of them finally together, their feelings remained mixed. The reunion itself was a reason for joy. Yet each of them was left with a nasty sense of foreboding at the forefront of their minds. They were face to face with the alliances' leading generals, as well as a newer, more powerful kind of soldat. 
That, along with the realization of just how powerful Ouroboros' forces could be, left them with happiness and fear in equal measure. Guided by Valimar, they made their way back to Ymir. Uh... I miss the day so I can just slap on information courts and not worry about anything. Well, we're back. Sorry for overworking you like that, Valimar. That is not a concern. With every battle that has overcome, my operational efficiency increases. That is a sign that you too are growing, my awakener. Me? I will return to a state of inactivity. Should you require me, you need only to call my name. Uh, looks like he fell asleep. We should let him rest for a while. Yusus? Yusus. Are you sure you're okay with leaving things that way? With your dad, I mean? I made my decision. I have no regrets. Now that I've made it, I intend to always look forward, not backwards. That's a great way to look at it, Yusus. Not like this means you'll never see him again. Uh, my, you've all matured so much since I last saw you. I couldn't be prouder. They've all gone through so much to come this far. So it seems. What's that? The Orville bike? Oh, you brought it for me, Valimar? That's considerate of you. Was it transported here along with us? Well, it was fairly close by. It must have been drawn to the spirit path. Overdrive icons increased to two. Alright, so let me have a second overdrive bar. That'll come in handy for some of these ridiculous battles. We used immediately one after NAR2, allowing for plenty new strategic possibilities. Welcome home, Reen. I see you were able to find the rest of your classmates. Yeah, this is everyone. It sure wasn't easy. I'm just glad we made it back in one piece. The last part was definitely the biggest pain. Indeed. Regardless, we wouldn't have been able to make it here if not for you all coming to find us. Thank you. <laughs> and naturally, that goes for you too, Celine. Yeah, yeah, whatever. <laughs> it's great to see you guys again. The winds must have been on your side. It sounds like there was some trouble along the way, but you came back, and that's all that matters. I can't say I'm surprised to find you're in good health, though. Ill weeds grow apace, after all. <laughs> I could say the same about you. Given how useless you are at anything you can't learn from a book, part of me expected we would next meet with you behind bars. Again. <sighs> It hasn't even been 30 damn seconds and I already want to kill you. Okay, my turn! He must have cast oh, Shining on themselves ahead of time. Because you were trying to hug me, obviously. Oh, come on. You know you want to. While I'd expected you to come back with your classmates, I didn't think you'd come back with Sarah, too. Not that anything had ever happened to you, of all people. Uh, thanks, I guess. <laughs> Certainly has gotten lively around here. <laughs> it sure has. You're looking a lot better, Dad. I'm still a ways from being back to my old self, but I'm finding it a lot easier to walk around. Toval and Captain Claire have kindly been handling both the village's security and correspondence with the other regions. Which means I can focus on my health. <laughs> We're not doing anything special, really. 
We're just glad that you've been getting better. That's not true at all. You've done so much for us, I don't even know where to begin thanking you. And Reen, I want you to know that we're both so proud of what you've accomplished. It couldn't have been easy coming this far, but you did it. You should hold your head high. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Oh, I wouldn't have been able to do any of it alone. It was only possible because everyone was with me. <laughs> well, I think we've been standing out here long enough. I've had rooms prepared for you all at the Phoenix Wing, so go ahead and rest there. Oh, nice. Isn't that where we stayed during our last visit? That's the one. I imagine you must all be exhausted after all that's transpired in the past few days. The open-air bath's finally been repaired, too. If you get the chance, you should enjoy a nice, relaxing bath after all your hard work. Dave and the separate slot just in case I ever uh, that was really why would they screw up my formation like this? Why? Alright, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe.